I'm going to show you how to register for Interaction Studio exams and not just Interaction Studio but rather any exams that you see in Partner Learning Camp. So to do that first go to Partner Learning Camp Learner Dashboard and you'll be asked to log in, log in with your partner credentials and then go to credentials search for the exam for example interaction studio now open the exam open the credential and look for this register button since i've completed the course the register button is deactivated but typically when you click on this button it will take you to the examity website for example i'll search for instant prediction builder and i go to register now this takes me to examity now if it doesn't if it doesn't take you to examity raise a support ticket and the salesforce support team would be happy to help you and second thing is don't you know just start the exam right away um, and also when you try to start the exam you have to pay for the exam so check with your company if they have a voucher code for your exams if not you'll have to pay it and let's see yeah. and few tips about examity so first when you start your examity exam you will be asked to install a chrome add-on and it's good to keep all the browsers closed. Second, right after you complete your examity exam, minimize any pop-up that that gets displayed to view your final results. Quite often when you click on end exam, you get a pop-up and when you uh, and you have one option to uh, you know close the pop-up and minimize it. When you click on close the pop-up you won't be able to see your exam results again. So you'd have to reach Salesforce support or examity support to get your results. So it's good to minimize those small pop-up windows to see your results before completing the exam. So yeah, these are the tips. Thank you.